Would you come join me as I warm up my voice to sing very, 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 very high notes? Let's sing. Okay, so why the very, very high notes? Well, I have set myself the challenge this week of singing Minnie Ripperton's Loving You, which gets high. Some call it whistle tone, some just call it very, very high notes. It is the top of any range. Not impossible to sing, but we do need to properly warm up our voices to get there, which is what we're about to do now. It's about 11.30 in the morning. I do not sing before then. Why? Because it takes a number of hours, some say four, for any water, any fluids, to hydrate our vocal cords and I'm not the earliest of risers so I need to allow as much time as possible to get my vocal cords nice and lubricated. But yeah, what we're going to do is basically just go on a journey to reaching those high notes. Okay, so as always with all of my vocal warm-ups, with all of my singing lessons, it starts with finding our breath. So you know the drill, it's in for five, holding for five and out 15, except I'm doing it this time. So, breathing. Ideally, I want to have blown out all of my breath by that 15 because it's all about controlling the out breath, resisting and controlling the out breath. So I'm going to do that one more time, again at the same speed, same pace. So breathing. Let's alter it slightly. Let's breathe out to a shh. This makes it more difficult because the air wants to rush out, but yeah, we're controlling that out breath. Okay, so breathing. my breath. So we can move on to some lovely SOVT and I'm going to do the puffer fish today. I've um, I found new love for the puffer fish. I still love my lip bubbles and don't worry we'll still we will be doing some lip bubbles but yeah the puffer fish is, is, is funky fun. So we're gonna do some slides. Up the third, up the fourth and up the fifth. Here I go and it's nice and gentle. We're just warming up. my left hand throughout this my left hand is on my tummy really feeling the breath down there and I'll come down after this
wobble up my legs. Now I'm going to move on and do those lovely lip bubbles and we're just going to do arpeggios. We started on the, on the C, let's start on the A. I should have said as well, lower voices. Because even though we're warming up to mini Ripperton levels, you know, low voices, you may not be able to get as high. Hey, you might. But yeah, start down the octave. So just some lip bubble arpeggios. And, in fact, actually, let's do two rounds. And, hand on tummy again. D. We're going to come down now. Let's try as we come down to, this is going to be a bit messy. <clears throat> yeah, so blowing raspberries rather than the lip bubbles. Let's get that tongue nice and exercised, nice and relaxed as well. Ready? And... Needs lots of air. the tongue nice and relaxed and also out of the way as you know our tongues are absolutely massive and get in the way all the time so I liked that that pulled it forward what I did do once with a singing teacher which I will do one day was trilling the tongue and the lips at the same time so like that Yeah, we'll do a video on that one day, but uh, but not today. Let's move on with a few tongue stretches. Again, this is not going to be pretty. Singing is not pretty. But yeah, just stretch your tongue out. 
Get it? Get it worked out. You're also going to work out the jaw at the same time. Maybe just rub the muscles here. And just really working everything out. You can do that. You can just put the tongue behind the teeth and stick it out so that you're still really, as I said, really stretching it at the back. Yes, okay, this is a vocal warm-up, but it is also a physical warm-up as well. Singing is a physical activity. Next up, it's a drinks break. Drinks break! Got to keep hydrated. It's allergy season and I suffer hugely from hay fever. It's, it's horrible, but I'm just drinking lots and lots and lots and lots of water. It's... It's helped. Okay, so we've done our SOVT. Now let's move on to some vowels and our good old trusted five note scale. And we're just gonna do an ooey. Ooey, and it's gonna be nice and ooh, hooty, nice and up here with some high heady resonance. Yes, okay, with our chest as well, but we're focusing on heady resonance today because that's what we need for the high notes. Who are you? Um, let's start actually, let's start on the A. Lower voices. Ready? And So let's come down and have the breath come through. It's just all about air, speed, 
coming through so that your vocal folds can vibrate nice and freely. They've got the power behind it. Okay, now we're going to do some octave arpeggios. And we're going to do the puppy whiny dog. Oh, 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 oh. So just an O, oh, but with that cry on it. Ready? This will be fun for your neighbors. <laughs> and oh, oh. Keep with that tr that cry, okay? cry. We got up to an F sharp, which is very high, very high um, whistle. whistle. <coughs> a thing to remember is to have that cry on it and to think of a whiny little puppy dog. Oh, 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 oh. That is how we can find a whistle tone. That's how we can find ridiculously high notes, the high notes that Minnie Ripperson sings in Loving You, which is the challenge for this week. So you're ahead of the game. And there you go, you know, challenge. Easy, high notes, easy. Thing to remember, always, always be connected to your powerhouse. Always have that breath coming through. If at any time you feel strain, you feel pain, that rhymes, I wasn't expecting it to, stop. Stop, don't, don't, don't push your voice until it is, it is ready. Stop, go back to do your SOVT, go back to doing your puffer fish, go back to doing your lip bubbles. Really lay those foundations before you do those ridiculously 
high notes. Okay, let's just, let's cool ourselves down a bit because we have, we've sung some very, very high notes. So let's go back to the puffer fish. Because I like it. Just to calm ourselves down. And we're going to do some, we're going to start up here and we're just going to work our way down. So lower voices, start down here. And then we're going to work, as I said, then we're going to go down. And we're just going to go. so much for watching I'm going to be drinking some more water and then I am going to be attacking Minnie Ripperton's Loving You which is just the most amazing amazing song but incredibly difficult to get those high notes her voice is incredible it's magic it's it's fantastic so you've made it to the end of the video which obviously means that you've enjoyed it so please do the youtubey things and like and subscribe it really does help and it means that you don't miss out on anything because new videos come every single week on Wednesdays we have sing and mix five minute warm-up exercise videos I sing and mix because it's the pick and mix at the cinema you can do one you can do five you can put together your own warm-up vocal routines all fantastic stuff and then on Fridays we have videos like this one so longer warm-up videos we also have we also have, <laughs> we also have song specific tutorial videos so let me know in the comments what songs what's your favorite songs what songs are you struggling with and I'll put together a little singing lesson singing tutorial for that or we'll just have music chat on a Friday yeah you know get a set up for the weekend but other than that I will